What exactly did this external review find then, Tom? Because it seemed to conclude that a lot of money went from one individual to another, but maybe that was at a distance from, from Apollo. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it's a really fascinating and, and probably the most detailed look we've ever had at kind of Epstein's business arrangements. So effectively what the report said was, as you say, uh, Leon Black paid something like $158 million to Epstein uh, over the course of 2012 to 2017. And that was basically for his personal tax affairs. So Leon Black's got a fortune of about $10 billion. And the law firm saying the reason he paid Epstein, as you say, a convicted paedophile, $158 million was because he saved him about $1 to $2 billion in potential tax charges. So, you know, the, the report makes clear there was a big difference between what Black was doing and, and there was never any money in Apollo managed funds from Epstein. Um, but obviously it's kind of, you know, uh, well, obviously we've seen Leon Black step down. Uh, so it's had a big impact and kind of plenty of questions still remain over, you know, what exactly was going on here. I mean, I, to, Tom, to me, away from Apollo and away from the markets, the headline should be Leon Black paid Jeffrey Epstein $158 million for services over five years as like a tax advisor. I mean, um, this is a story of a, a, a U.S. billionaire paying a convicted sex offender hundreds of millions of dollars. I mean, with the lending, it brings him $200 million into Jeffrey Epstein. And the report found that he visited Epstein's home in New York multiple times and his other homes around the world as well um, in order to, like, what, cut his tax bill by one or two billion dollars, which even that strikes me as uh, concerning. Yeah, I mean, look, the U.S. tax system does not command this at all well, the fact that someone like uh, a Leon Black can save, you know, one, two billion dollars. Um, and the fact, you know, you're relying on, on people like Epstein to uh, to enable that. Uh, so, you know, it's hugely uh, embarrassing, hugely kind of uncomfortable reading for Leon Black. And, and you know, to be fair, he, he really didn't want to step down as CEO. We understand over the weekend there was sort of plenty of to and fro with, with uh, you know, people urging him to, to, to leave. Um, so, uh, yeah, I know it's an extraordinary story. And, yeah, as I said, it, you know, no one comes out of it looking, looking good. And, you know, that $158 million, 200 million with lending basically kept Epstein in the the lifestyle he was became accustomed to, um, which was always one of the great mysteries. Like how on earth did Epstein get so rich? And it appears you know one of the ways was he was uh, sort of you know aggressively helping people uh, with their tax schemes.